of the greatest pieces of advice I could give anybody is don't be a sellout. Make sure that you retain your rock and roll soul. You know, we start out our careers with a lot of rebellion. We want change. We want to overthrow the establishment. We're part of the rebel forces. And that energy is important. And it's important in an organization because it connects to innovation, change, entrepreneurial spirit. So you got to retain that rebellious, maverick-like nature. Over time, what happens is you start to become part of the establishment. The very authority figures you tried to overthrow, now you are one of them. But that's not all bad because the establishment comes with ballast, reasonability, good judgment, and wisdom. And over time, we have to manage the two tensions. We have to be loyal to the organization bringing our institutional knowledge. But we don't want to lose that rebellious spirit that we came in with. We got to be loyal rebels. Always reclaim your rock and roll soul. I think of all the rock and roll that gave me my energy and my entrepreneurial spirit. I think of the Rolling Stones and Street Fighting Man. I think of Heart with Barracuda. I think of The Who and Baba O'Reilly. I think of John Fogarty and Fortunate Son. I think of anything by Alanis Morissette on Jagged Little Pill. I think of Public Enemy and Fight the Power. I think of U2 and Bullet the Blue Sky and Sunday Bloody Sunday. All that rock and roll that gives me vinegar and nuclear fission inside of my soul that gives me the energy to move me forward. Never forget your rock and roll soul. Join the movement, throw your fist up in the air, and keep the rock and roll in your soul.